girly girl. Kind of quirky too. Whimsical. Fun. It doesn't get much girlier than this, baking in a cozy kitchen, pink apron and all. You can tell Sabrina Perfit of Sugar Mama Pastries isn't your average Whistlerite. They're just wee little cakes in themselves and you can make them so pretty. White fluffy icing piped onto mini cupcakes as delicate as a wedding gown. But these beauties don't need to be saved for a special occasion. This baker slash edible artist can always be found at the Whistler Farmer's Market. Last week I had a fellow stand at my table and eat five cupcakes. He just stood there and just ate, handed me more money, ate another one, handed me more money, ate another one, till he was full. Happy, happy, happy. Yeah, that's good. Perfit insists the unique flavors, like her spicy zucchini cupcake, come from the love and care used to create these decadent pieces from scratch, using local ingredients when possible. After all, an artist's blank canvas can be the most important part. Her favorite mixture and most popular treat, the red velvet cupcake. Oh, they are so pretty. The combination of the red with the milk being added to it turns it this bright, dark fuchsia pink. And then you add the dry ingredients and it becomes a different color and then you bake it. Rolling the fondant icing and creating unique designs that top her cakes, Sugar Mama Pastries is as much about design as it is taste. You know, each, each little rosette is its own little challenge. And I, I delight in making a beautiful rosette. And I really enjoy watching people eat them and seeing the satisfaction that they get. Like most people in this rugged mountain town, she loves to explore and create treats even outdoor enthusiasts will enjoy, encouraging everyone to satisfy their sweet tooth. It's a treat. It's a sweet treat. It's, um, it just makes you feel good. Especially when it's created in a small home kitchen that sits tucked away on Blueberry Hill. From Whistler, I'm Heather Butts for Shaw TV.